now, your local Las Vegas weather. Gusty wind out there today, and the wind will stay with us as we head into the weekend. Forecast winds behind me. We've got the temperature forecast right here. We're hovering in those lower 100s this afternoon, and we will get cooler as we head into the weekend. But the wind gusts between 30 and 40 out there this afternoon. That will continue into the early evening tonight. Wind will settle down overnight tonight, not as windy with temperatures gradually finding their way into the 80s early tomorrow morning. We'll start with low 80s, upper 70s in the Las Vegas Valley before the wind does ramp back up again tomorrow. But I think you'll notice the difference tomorrow, mid 90s at lunchtime, and then we'll be struggling to hit 100 tomorrow. Haven't been able to say that for the past two months as we've been so hot this summer, but temperatures are falling back tomorrow and we'll be back into the mid 90s for your weekend plans. Get outside, this is the live look from the sunset cam and certainly see the wind blowing coming in from the south southwest and with the dry conditions over the valley and the gusty wind, a red flag warning is up, a fire weather warning also known as, and that is means that the fire danger is elevated. Simply if a brush fire were to break out, could spread quickly with the wind and the dry conditions outside. Showers and storms focused east of the valley. We had one lone shower we were tracking last hour, popped up north of Nellis Air Force Base and the Speedway, fizzling out as it crossed I-15. This is where the activity is, just east of Mesquite. A lot of thunderstorm activity in the Mojave County, Arizona. And these storms have a good amount of juice with them, meaning that some heavy downpours are certainly possible. So that is why a flood watch is up for those areas east of Mesquite into southern Utah. And a watch means exactly that. Watch out. Conditions are favorable. That flash flooding is a, certainly a potential as we head to the evening tonight with those storms off to the east. For us here in the Las Vegas Valley, the Pahrump Valley, not getting a piece of this moisture. It's really focused off to the east tonight. So that will be moving off to the east. For us, it's mainly the wind. That's the story, and that's a sign of some cooler changes for the weekend. 102 degrees, 13% the relative humidity, some pretty dry air right on top of the valley. 76 your morning start in Henderson, 67 Pahrump, and then highs tomorrow making that run toward 100. I've got us right at 100 for the forecast high tomorrow, and we will keep that first alert up for tomorrow and Saturday with those wind gusts 30 to 40 miles per hour. So you'll notice the wind the next couple days. Looking longer range at next week, Friday and Saturday, the 30th and 31st. Just a slight shower chance in the forecast, so we'll monitor that. In the meantime, though, the cooler air just in time for the weekend. Mid 90s for highs, coolest weather we have felt in more than two months with morning lows in the 70s. And then next week, a lot of sunshine through Thursday with high temperatures hovering in that 100 to 105 range for the first half of next week. Fox 5 News will continue right after the break.